I initially checked the solar panel provides enough power. Then I started building the prototype. This version will be powered by a battery being charged by the solar panel. It will monitor the humidity, temperature, pressure and voltage of the battery itself. All of this will be controlled by a Wemos D1 Mini and that will be transmitted to a MQTT server. After uploading the program to Wemos, I confirmed the power and tested its operation. Then I drew the PCB in the Autodesk Eagle. This has a free version that allows you to design PCBs with two wires and 80 square centimeters of area. After drawing the schematic, it generates the footprints of the components. Just make the connections and place them in the desired location. Finally, it's necessary to generate Gerber files to send to PCB away. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. They have been supporters of the channel for some time. Ordering PCBs on PCBWay is extremely simple. Just indicate the size, the desired quantity and submit the Gerber files. PCBWay creates and ships PCBs quickly. When assembling, the components fit seamlessly. Welding is done easily and the PCBs have an excellent finish. Place your order and receive a $5 welcome bonus. After loading all the components, I started building the box. For that, I used the waterproof case that I had. I installed a waterproof cable connector to pass the connection to the sensors and designed a support for the installation of an air filter in Autodesk Fusion 360. This filter allows air to circulate, preventing condensation and preventing foreign objects from entering. I also designed supports for the PCB and the solar panel. After installing the solar panel, I started building the box where the sensors will be stored, being the installation similar to the main box. After connecting all the components, I installed a fixing bracket in the box. Then installed the filters in both boxes. This consists of a piece of fabric stuck between two printed supports. Finally, I installed the weather station outside and checked the data.
I hope you like this project. I've got other project videos, so check those out and don't forget to subscribe.